Wednesday night training. Yeah, Simo called all the boys in. It was like 10 minutes into training. Called all the boys in and um, now I said I was playing. And obviously I said shot a goal. And obviously I was joking around and that. Uh, if he kicks his goal. Oh! He gave me the call up playing in the derby, first game. And straight away nerves hit me. Bit anxious, didn't know what to expect. Didn't realise how big the derby was. I just wanted to focus on playing my role and go out there and enjoy the moment, enjoy the experience. A lot of pressure on West Coast heading into Derby 45 after that loss to Hawthorne. They play so much better at this venue, Domain Stadium. I reckon the main part that I'll always remember is running out, running up the race and running through the banner and just like looking around, looking at the crowd. Yeah, that's probably one of the, one of the main things I remember. First away trip, you know, obviously against Port Adelaide. Boys were pretty excited to get over there and, you know, you get, get to jail with the boys um, away from Perth. I didn't know what to expect, so a sort of a learning experience for me. Um, I haven't played on the ground like that before, so I've played on the G, but I reckon that's up there with, nearly up there with the G, so yeah, I reckon that's probably on par with the best ground I've played on. And out the back, West Coast have got some numbers. Mutima down there and he juggles it with the one hand. I don't think I touched the ball in the first quarter, so I knew I had to do something in the second quarter and just wanted to get my hands on the ball, really. Um, play my role. Lucky enough, I was stretching back and got my hands on it. Uh, took the mark and went back and realised I had to keep going now once I took the mark. So, yeah, it was pretty relaxed going back and yeah, just, just kicked it. Now lining up for the very first goal of his career. Kurt Mutima directly in front, loved it off the boot. These teammates will celebrate with him. He kicks the first goal of his career. Each week he's got a bit more confident and um, comfortable with what's going on, so it's really pleasing that you know, Mook can play some pretty good footy. Um, so you know, I think he's got a bright future, but um, it's all about how hard you want to keep working pretty much now. Sets it on its way. That is a beautiful finish. East Perth get there first. Coming into this year, well, the first five or six games I've played at the Waffle, you know, I just wanted to perform. And luckily enough, I think there was like two or three games where I did all right and then got the call up. And since then, it's just been, yeah, it's gone so quick, just taking it every week as it comes, really. He's really taken it with both hands. He's in good form playing as a midfielder, but he's got the attributes to, and the speed to be able to play that high half forward role. And we're really seeing some improvement in what he's doing as a forward. Now for Mutima. He has to wait for it to bounce. It sits up for him. He's got support. Shepard. Yeah, I'm happy to play a new role. Obviously, coming to the Eagles, you know, we're stacked in the midfield, we've got that much talent in there. So to play that forward role, personally, adds like another another string to my bow, really. Um, and yeah, sort of learning each week new areas of that role and uh, building on my game, playing that high forward. So yeah, I'm happy to play that high forward role. Uh, I love the beach. Yeah, I love it. I think I'm down there like every second day, even though it's cold at the moment, I still go down there. So yeah, I just love, love the, the life, that sort of beachy life and then obviously playing footy. Sort of takes the mind off, you know, missing home and that. So yeah, just enjoying, enjoying everything at the moment.